Law of Signs. It requires SSA, AAS, or the reverses. In order for you to use Law of Signs, you need two different formulas. They're just one formula, but I'm counting it as two. So, how do you use this formula? It's simple. Just find the right size, put on some shoes, go run a marathon, boil some tea, plug in the right numbers, and you got the Law of Signs. And there goes the Law of Signs. Congratulations, you have now just achieved a new useless information that you can brag to your friends about. Law of Cosines. The more useful, the less popular formula. Where the Law of Cosines is a popular football player, the Law of Cosines is basically you. The Law of Cosines requires SAS, SSS, and their reverses. Wait, hold on. Did the same thing. The Law of Signs has two formulas. One of them is to find the angle and the other one is to find the side. I think there is a third formula, but I think that's just there to mentally torture you. To solve for an angle of a triangle using Law of Cosines, you need to plug in the corresponding number to their letters. Like this. To solve for a side using Law of Cosines, you need to do the exact same thing but with this formula instead. Again, another piece of useless information that you are never going to use. I'm starting to sense a pattern here. So, what did you learn? Absolutely nothing, I'm just doing this for a grade. But if this was not enough, here is a link to a song that was made.